Did you know that eating a seemingly ordinary fruit like watermelon can improve your GFR? GFR, or glomerular filtration rate, is a key indicator of kidney health. It tells how well your kidneys are filtering your blood. A GFR of 60 or more is normal. Below 60 means your kidneys might not be working well, and below 15 indicates kidney failure. Normally, kidneys are efficient at filtering waste and maintaining balance, but unhealthy lifestyle choices and certain health conditions can degrade their function and reduce GFR. This can show up in the form of symptoms like swollen feet or ankles, sleep problems, fatigue, muscle cramps, changes in urination, high blood pressure, and itchy skin due to toxins and waste buildup in the body. So, maintaining a healthy GFR is important. To do that, watermelon can be very helpful. But watermelon isn't the only fruit that can benefit your kidneys. In this video, let's learn about the eight best fruits that can help improve your GFR and improve your kidney health. Let's begin. The first fruit on our list is watermelon. Watermelon can help improve kidney health and GFR in several ways. First, it acts as a natural diuretic and is about 92% water. Diuretics are substances that increase urine production. Watermelon's high water content and diuretic properties keep you hydrated and help the kidneys effectively flush out waste and toxins from the body by increasing urine flow without stressing them. Secondly, watermelon contains antioxidants, including vitamin C and lycopene, a compound that gives it its red color. These antioxidants fight free radicals in your body, including your kidneys. Free radicals are basically unstable molecules with unpaired electrons that can damage cells, proteins, and DNA, contributing to inflammation and diseases. By neutralizing these free radicals, vitamin C and lycopene help protect kidney cells from damage, support overall kidney health, and can help in maintaining a healthy GFR. Moreover, watermelon has some essential nutrients, including citrulline, which helps the liver process ammonia, a byproduct of protein digestion. This is helpful for the kidneys because the liver converts ammonia into urea, which has to be filtered out of the blood by the kidneys. By helping the liver in this process, watermelon reduces the amount of ammonia that the kidneys need to filter and reduces stress on them. Watermelon also contains minerals, including potassium. Potassium helps balance electrolytes and supports overall kidney function. However, it's important to eat fruits that are low in potassium because when your kidneys have a lower GFR, they cannot filter excess potassium efficiently, which can stress them. The good news is that watermelon is low in potassium. 100 grams contain about 112 milligrams of potassium, which is relatively low compared to the daily allowed intake for kidney patients, which is about 2,000 milligrams. Additionally, watermelon is also low in sodium, so it usually does not raise blood pressure, the second leading cause of kidney failure in the U.S. This further makes a watermelon kidney-friendly diet. To get these benefits, you can enjoy watermelon in many ways, like watermelon smoothies, juices, and fresh watermelon slices. However, remember that while watermelon is low in potassium and sodium, it can be concerning if you already have any kidney issues or eat it in excess. So, aim to eat about one cup of watermelon per day. For this, instead of cutting it into wedges, slice it into bite-sized pieces, measure one cup, and enjoy. Number two, apple. Apples are rich in dietary fiber, particularly soluble fiber known as pectin. This kind of fiber can indirectly benefit your kidneys in several ways. Firstly, this soluble fiber absorbs water and forms gel which traps the sugar from the food you eat and slows the absorption of sugars into the bloodstream, which helps regulate blood sugar levels. This is important because high blood sugar, common in diabetes, can damage blood vessels in the kidneys and lead to kidney disease. By helping to manage blood sugar levels, pectin can reduce your risk of kidney damage, leading to degraded kidney function and lower GFR. Secondly, pectin helps lower blood cholesterol levels by binding to cholesterol in the digestive tract and preventing its absorption. This is helpful because high cholesterol can build up in your blood vessels, supplying kidneys, and block them resulting in reduced blood supply. In fact, a study involving 4,500 men for 14 years has shown that men having high cholesterol levels or reduced good cholesterol levels were at higher risk of reduced GFR. So pectin can help you lower cholesterol and improve GFR. Moreover, apples also contain many antioxidants, including vitamin C, 
quercetin, catechin, and chlorogenic acid. These antioxidants can neutralize free radicals and protect your kidneys from damage and inflammation. Particularly quercetin in apples has anti-inflammatory properties, so it can efficiently help to increase the GFR of your kidneys. Moreover, apples are low in potassium, sodium, and phosphorus, all minerals that can be concerning for your kidneys. 100 grams of apples contain 107 milligrams of potassium, which is too low compared to the daily allowed potassium intake for kidney patients. So apples will not strain kidneys and are a great addition to a kidney-friendly diet. To improve kidney health and GFR, eat one apple daily, either in slices or in the form of apple juice. Number three, blueberries. Blueberries are packed with antioxidants, including vitamin C, vitamin K, and anthocyanins. These antioxidants neutralize free radicals, reducing oxidative stress and inflammation in the kidneys. This protection helps prevent kidney cells from damage and can support your overall kidney health. This can improve their functioning and increase GFR. Blueberries are also a good source of dietary fiber, which helps regulate blood sugar levels and support digestive health. As we have mentioned earlier, by managing blood sugar levels, fiber can reduce the risk of diabetes-related kidney damage. Moreover, blueberries are low in potassium, sodium, and phosphorus. A half cup of these berries has less than 150 milligrams of potassium. This makes them suitable for a kidney-friendly diet because as we have discussed, degraded kidneys may not remove excess potassium and their levels may increase in your blood, leading to serious health concerns, including irregular heartbeats, arrhythmias, muscle weakness, and even cardiac arrest. So if you have compromised kidney function, blueberries are a safe and healthy option for you. To get their benefits, eat a half cup of blueberries several times a week. You can eat them plain or add them to yogurt, cereals, and pancakes. Number four, red grapes. Red grapes are rich in antioxidants, such as vitamin C, flavonoids, and resveratrol. These antioxidants neutralize free radicals, causing damage, reduce inflammation, and support overall kidney function. In addition to their antioxidant properties, red grapes have anti-inflammatory effects. Chronic inflammation can contribute to kidney damage and disease, so reducing inflammation can help you maintain healthy kidneys and improve GFR. Red grapes are also a good source of fiber. Fiber helps regulate blood sugar levels and can prevent diabetes-related kidney issues. So, by managing blood sugar, fiber supports kidney health and can reduce the risk of complications. Moreover, red grapes are low in potassium. Their one cup serving of approximately 151 grams contains about 288 milligrams of potassium. This makes them suitable for your kidney-friendly diet. To enjoy these benefits, you can eat red grapes fresh add them to salads, or blend them into smoothies. However, remember to consume not more than half a cup of red grapes per day. This amount provides the benefits of red grapes without overloading the kidneys with potassium or other nutrients that need to be monitored in a kidney diet. Number five, cranberries. Cranberries are also rich in antioxidants, particularly vitamin C and various phytonutrients. Like others, these antioxidants help neutralize free radicals reducing oxidative stress and inflammation in the kidneys. So, by protecting kidney cells from damage, cranberries can support overall kidney function and help maintain a healthy GFR. Cranberries also have natural compounds that can prevent urinary tract infections, UTIs, which can be particularly helpful for kidney health. This is because UTIs can lead to kidney infections if not managed properly, so consuming cranberries may help reduce the risk of such infections and protect your kidneys. Furthermore, cranberries are low in potassium, sodium, and phosphorus, which makes them suitable for your kidney-friendly diet. 100 grams of cranberries contain 40 milligrams of potassium, which is relatively very low as compared to the daily allowed intake. To benefit from cranberries, opt for about 50 to 80 grams, or about half a cup to one cup of cranberries several times a week. You can enjoy them fresh, drink cranberry juice, or add dried cranberries to salads and snacks. Number six, pineapples. Pineapples are also a great option for supporting kidney health and improving GFR. One of the amazing properties of pineapples is their content of bromelain, a digestive enzyme that can help dissolve kidney stones. By breaking down these stones, 
bromelain helps in their removal and reduces the risk of blockages that can impact your kidney function and GFR. Pineapples are also high in fiber, which is beneficial for your overall health. The fiber helps regulate blood sugar levels and supports heart health. This is particularly important since heart complications are common in people undergoing dialysis. So, maintaining heart health through a high fiber diet can indirectly benefit kidney function. Additionally, pineapples are a good source of vitamin C, which boosts the immune system. A strong immune system helps protect against infections and supports overall health, which is important for maintaining kidney function and improving GFR. Moreover, pineapples are low in potassium, containing 109 milligrams of potassium in 100 grams, which makes them a suitable choice for managing kidney disease. This low potassium content helps to maintain fluid and electrolyte balance without overloading the kidneys. To enjoy these benefits, opt for half to a cup of pineapple several times a week. You can eat pineapples fresh, add them to smoothies, or use them in different dishes. Number seven, raspberries. Raspberries are an excellent choice for supporting kidney health and improving GFR due to their rich nutrient profile. They are particularly high in phytonutrients, including ellagic acid, which helps neutralize free radicals in the body, including your kidneys. By reducing oxidative stress, ellagic acid protects kidney cells from damage and can support overall kidney function. In addition to ellagic acid, Raspberries contain flavonoids, which have been shown to improve kidney function. These compounds may also help reduce the growth of cancer cells, providing an additional layer of protection for the body. The anti-inflammatory and antioxidant properties of flavonoids contribute to better kidney health. Raspberries are also an excellent source of essential nutrients, such as manganese, vitamin B, vitamin C, fiber, and folate. Manganese and vitamins B and C play crucial roles in maintaining metabolic health and supporting the immune system. Fiber helps regulate blood sugar levels and supports heart health, while folate is important for cell function and repair. All of these benefits can efficiently support your overall kidney health. Moreover, raspberries are also low in potassium, with 100 grams containing about 151 milligrams of potassium. This further makes them a good choice for you in improving your kidney health and GFR. To get the benefits of raspberries, eat about a half cup of them several times a week. You can enjoy them fresh, add them to smoothies or yogurt, or use them in different recipes. Number eight, strawberries. Strawberries can also be beneficial for kidney health and improving GFR due to their rich nutrient and antioxidant content. They contain two types of phenols, anthocyanins and elagitanins. These compounds play a key role in improving kidney function by reducing inflammation and protecting kidney cells from damage. Strawberries are also an excellent source of vitamin C, manganese, and fiber. Vitamin C boosts the immune system and helps in tissue repair, while manganese supports metabolic processes. The fiber in strawberries helps regulate blood sugar levels and supports heart health, both of which are important for maintaining kidney function. To get these benefits, opt for half a cup of strawberries, which contain about 130 milligrams of potassium, you can enjoy fresh strawberries, add them to smoothies, or include them as toppings in different dishes. In addition to eating these eight fruits for better kidney function and improved GFR, avoiding some fruits can also help. Let's discuss some of them. Number one, bananas. Bananas are high in potassium with about 422 milligrams per medium-sized banana. As we have discussed, managing potassium intake is important to reduce stress on damaged kidneys and avoid complications. Since the recommended daily limit for potassium is typically less than 2,000 milligrams, regularly consuming bananas can make it challenging to stay within this limit. Therefore, if you have kidney issues or you want to improve your kidney function monitor and possibly limit your banana intake. Number two, avocados. Avocados are also high in potassium with one avocado weighing about 200 grams containing 975 milligrams of potassium. This amount is nearly half of the daily recommended limit for individuals with kidney disease. Therefore, for managing kidney issues, be cautious about your avocado intake to avoid exceeding potassium intake limits. Number three, dried fruits. 
Dried fruits are generally not recommended for individuals with renal disease or diabetes due to their high content of sugars and minerals. For instance, half a cup, 65 grams, of dried apricots contains about 755 milligrams of potassium. This amount is significant, especially if you have kidney issues. Moreover, dried fruits are rich in fast-digesting sugars, which can lead to rapid increases in blood sugar levels. This is particularly concerning for individuals with diabetes, as managing blood sugar levels is crucial to prevent complications. The combination of high potassium and concentrated sugars makes dried fruits a less suitable choice for those with these health conditions. Number four, oranges. Oranges and orange juice are well known for their high vitamin C and antioxidant content. However, they also contain a significant amount of potassium, which can be problematic. So, it's best to avoid or limit oranges and orange juice on a renal diet. 